Viewer beware, you're in for a scare. You all be my slaves. Slappy here. This is Dark Dimensions Haunted House, and today we're doing a video on Goosebumps from Trick or Treat Studios. Unfortunately, Trick or Treat Studios, they lost their license, but there is rumors that they will be getting the license back. So I emailed Trick or Treat Studios, and as of right now, 2021, that they don't have it yet. They're still working on it. So hoping that 2022, that they'll get the license back. All right, we'll start with Slappy. Slappy is one of their dummies, their dolls that they have right there. He comes with a suit. He's got a bow tie, his flower. He's latex. He also comes with this card. He comes with a card. It's right there by your hand. It's right here. And if you read the line right there... I can't read that You can't... If you read that right there, he will come to live. I'm looking for the because I can't read that. So this right here, this one is one of the real... Like all the Trick or Treat Studios Goosebumps items that they have, they're really hard to get. There's two masks that you can get, but the dummy, he sells for a lot. How much do they have them for on eBay? I don't know. He goes for a lot. I've seen him go for a lot, but the boys, they got this for Christmas, so we have one of the Goosebumps. The other company that makes them is the Scary Closet. Oh yeah, there's something. Yeah. The Scary Closet makes uh, replicas also, but here is Slappy. Don't get the dust. The dust doesn't come with the dog. You're in for a scare. He's got his shoes right there. He's uh, bendable also. He's polyfoam, I believe, and he's bendable so he can be posed. So that is Slappy, the evil dummy. Well, speaking of Slappy, they had some other items. They had PVC masks they made. And Fright Rags did these too. Fright Rags did them too? Shirt. Oh yeah. So that's a Fright Rag shirt? Yes. So that's Fright Rags. They have the Goosebumps. He walks, he stalks. That's what your shirt says. All right, so we have these right here, the PVC mask. Let's go ahead and get some close-ups of these. They are made of PVC, they're not latex. They have Slappy, this is the book version, not the TV show. No. And then Scarlet, you have, which one is that? That's the haunted mask that Carly Beth wore. I was hoping you would have wore your I Carly. Was <laughs> I was, yeah. So the PVC masks are from the books, and the latex are from the show. Yeah, because remember, the dark haired floppy was too scary when they did the show. Yeah, that was too scary. Too so scary. They made the movies. Yeah. yeah. And then there's the haunted mask that Carly Beth wore. Just there like you that? go. Because <laughs> you did have your uh, your overalls and your pink shirt, Scarlet. Ooh, Jennifer wants you to be her bride. <laughs> so, how much were those? They they went for probably like nineteen ninety nine. About. Um, I guess so. Oh, they were cheap. I don't remember. Maybe twelve. So those were those items that they had. Other items that they did carry were the enamel pins. Enamel pins were... They had curly too, but... They had curly? I don't have curly. The only ones that we have right there is Slappy and the Haunted Mask. The curly one was cool too, though. There's a curly one. Also, if you notice, look at Jen's rings. Her bling bling. Oh, me and Scarlet. Y'all got y'all's uh, rings right there. There you go. You got the gerbil. Oh, Curly's that skeleton. Yeah. And then, uh, the what, what's the ones you have, Jen? I got the shrunken head and that monster. I forgot. That monster. Name. I don't know. I don't remember his name. His I name is Monster. The mouse monster. on mine. The mouse. Yeah, the, the hamster. The hamster and Curly. He got Curly. So there are more items that they have. Now this goes for about six hundred bucks on eBay now. Oh yeah. Yes. I see that. That's the haunted mask, and that's from the TV show. And uh. That one right there, it goes for a lot. You can still get well, Attack of the Jack-O-Lanterns the and mask, Slappy. The honey mask. 
and Slappy are the most popular ones. But that's Haunted Mask Part 1. Yes. Yeah, then the movies. Oh, yeah, right, turn around. You can even see like all the details. Like right there, they got the veins. The little thingies. All those little knots. But I wonder what made Carly Beth go into Halloween store and this is the scariest thing she found. That is the scariest uh -huh. thing right there. It's the only coolest thing we had at the shop. Mm -hmm. the <laughs> they had cool stuff. Really? <laughs> Alright, so that's the Haunted Mask Part 1. Yeah. They have the Haunted Mask Part 2, another one that is hard to get. And, and hard to get. That's what I do. Oh, I, I didn't even notice all the little spider webs. I, I put that. Oh, you put that there? Oh, we just put a bunch of spider rings did not come with it. Oh, okay, I thought that. And remember in the thing, he had spiders in his hair? So I put spiders. Oh, you, so you customized and made it even better. I customized. All right, so this is the Goosebumps, the Haunted Mask 2. I'm going to get some close-up details of this sculpt. That one's a hard one also to get. Like I said, the ones that you can get and you can still get in stores is the uh, Attack of the Jack-O-Lanterns and Slappy. Slappy. You can still buy Slappy in the store? Yeah. You can still, yeah. Those two that they still have, but the, the Haunted Mask, and the, Haunted the Mask PVC, too. and the Slappy, um, the doll, those are hard to get. I'm surprised they have Slappy. I haven't seen Haunted Mask too. It's very rare. There was one time on eBay that I saw all four masks, the latex ones, and they wanted two hundred dollars. So it was like fifty dollars each. Well, that's not bad. I mean, because they're, they're really hard to get now. All right. So next we have a Jack. Uh, a Jack. We have Attack of the Jack Lanterns. This one was really neat. I was hoping the kids would have got like three of them, and they would have wore their little black robes and went trick or treating. There's only two kids. Oh, there was two kids. Oh, yeah. maybe it's the book or something. I thought I saw a three. No, that's just the cover. But in the show, it's just a boy and a girl, and they're playing a prank, but they're really alien. Yeah. Alien. Yeah. <laughs> the weird alien. And that's Ar cool. that's Arlstein for you. So let's go and check out this, the Attack of the Jack-O-Lanterns mask from Trick or Treat Studios. That one. And uh, you notice that the eyes... Yeah, the eyes, they have that black mesh to, like, hide your eyes. I was seeing if they had any in the mouth part, but they, uh, they don't. Now it's just black. Yeah. But in the mouth, yes. So this one, yeah, you can still find this one in the stores. And this one is cool. I'm surprised it didn't sell out. Yeah. And it goes for about, like, $49.99. Now, hopefully they're next... If they ever do get the license up, I want the money. I, I hope they come out with um, um, calling all creeps. Calling all creeps. Mm -hmm. They have a lot of other potential. I think they probably would have made more if they would have had the license, but they only made four of them, four different ones. So this one is Slappy, right there. Slappy the dummy. Slappy the dummy. And here's his mask. Like I said, you can still get this one in the store. So and this it costs, one's a cool one, so yeah, get it. uh, it's forty nine ninety nine. Also, not bad, not bad. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Not bad, not bad. He just needs his daddy. <laughs> so yeah, he has uh, holes in the the pupils of his eyes, so that's where you look out of. Uh, there's holes in the ear, and I don't know if there's any in the mouth. Right now. No. No. Not the nose? The nose, yeah. Alright, I was going to say. So and the breathe. eyes and the ears, that's it. They, they, they made it COVID friendly. <laughs> Pretty much. So, yeah, my kid, or my son, he wore this for Halloween one year. And he had the little suit to go with it. And he was the most popular dummy for but, trick or treating. But do you remember the old, old Goosebump costumes that they used to have? Oh, yeah. Like... I think the store saw him, and one of the kids dressed as Flappy, and they thought he was a... Uh, oh, they thought he was a president. They thought he was a president. Yeah. <laughs> You're running for president. Yeah, sure am. Yeah, so there's those items those right cool. here. Those are cool. I don't think that mask got broken. Cool. So, Jen, she's a fan of Goosebumps, the show. I am. And that's why we got all these uh, collectibles. Right I don't here. have all of them. So, we're going to hold those up and show you. We got the Goosebumps, 
this one is the blob that ate everyone. They also have Goosebumps Ghost Beach. Let me go ahead and get a little bit closer here. So there's that one. I don't remember watching that one. Is that one pretty much like Creep Show? I'm assuming. It has three of the ep the best episode in this one was the Barking Ghost. The Barking Ghost. Yeah. Now I need to uh, rewatch this. We used to watch these with the kids. And be careful what you wish for. <laughs> There's this one. There's one day at Horrorland. I'm not really a big fan on the Horrorland ones. They need to bust out with the mask though. Yeah, they would Way sell. Way back in the day, they used to have they made masks of them. Yeah. You need to bring it on back. They would sell. I don't have any of those. I remember seeing this one. Uh, the night. What is it? Uh, got that ring light right there. The night in Terror Tower. Yeah. That was like the museum that they had, right? Yeah, the medieval museum. The torture. So they have the headless ghost. I don't remember seeing that one. Did yeah. you watch that one? I've or seen is there all more these than... a thousand oh, times. Oh, so there's more than one episode on it. Yeah. Yeah. And the funny thing about this one, do you remember when, uh, when it was Hollywood Video, when Hollywood Video and Blockbuster went out? What is that? I've never heard of that before. Shut up, stupid. <laughs> what is Hollywood well, Video? Well, I went and bought all of them. Yep. <laughs> all of them that I could find, and I found Slappy Part. So there's three. Yeah, Part Three. The that one's old... the that one's the one that was really funny, right? Where the kid. Yeah. The really bad effect, don't you? This one, I don't know how I didn't see it right there, but there was a kid that played the dummy, right? And he was sitting in that chair, and it was it was so cheesy, that part where the kid was alive. <laughs> or he was sitting there as the dummy. Yeah, he was the dummy. Yeah. All right, so Zane. it was that one. I don't right. know what happened in my first or my second part. All right, so this one is The Cry of the Cat. That's one of your favorites, Now, I don't right? care how lame I am. I love this one. Look at her. She's so spooky. <laughs> Look at how scary that is. That is scary. Aren't you intimidated? Yeah. She was a, a lonely gal. When did these come? These were the 90s or 2000s, I believe, right? It says 2005. Okay. So there's that, that one. one. That one, I like Attack of the jack lanterns And that's where they made that one mask that we just showed you recently. Attack of the jack lanterns So then... Yeah. There's the werewolf of Fever Swamp. And then if you look in the one. back, you see the little boy from Freddy vs. Jason. Ah, see? <laughs> they all started somewhere. They did all start somewhere. And so the next one... Jen also does have the Arlstein books and Arlstein movies, but this one's all based on Goosebumps. So, Goosebumps, oh, go eat worms. Oh, the Revenge of the Law no. Oh, that, was that one. one. <laughs> that was so cheesy that it was bad. I loved it. I Those loved gnomes it. I that loved came it. alive in the garden. Then there's Say Cheese and Die. That was and the then camera. That little Brian Goss, that little boy from the notebook. That's him as a little, little boy. See, once again, yeah. they all started, they all started cool somewhere. with the goosebumps. They start with goosebumps. And then we have My Best Friend is Invisible. I haven't seen that one. No, but the best one is. An old story with the little boys that give them. Oh, the okay, I have seen that one. Where they, <laughs> the antidote. They give them like prune juice, and it's to turn them old, and yeah, to make them young again. They have to eat baby food. Yeah, yeah. It, it was really funny seeing kids try to act like old people. But it's funny because this old lady was gonna sell those little boys and pimp them out to her friends. Oh they yeah. They bought them. It's almost like a little prostitution thing. <laughs> but it was good stuff. Yeah, R. O. Stein. Where were you going with that? <laughs> so you have this one's a double feature, scary house. And the trilogy was Scary House that uh, board game. Yeah. Yeah, and that okay. one's good. Yeah, and was it show on the back? Any famous people there? No, no, not in this one. No. Nope. All right. So this one is a double feature. It's the Ghost Next Door and Shocker on Shock Street. No, Shocker on Shock Street. That one's a popular one. Worst. That one's the with the robots. I love that one. Yeah. It's like the haunted house. They go into a dark ride haunted house and we're just moving on. Nobody cares. Nobody cares All right. what you think about that haunted right, house. All right, so uh, this one, The Scarecrow Walks at Midnight. Trick or Treat Studios, if you get the license back, that one would be really good. I actually like that one. That and one's this one right here, up. Calling All Creeps. Calling All Creeps. Yeah, that I was love a it, one. I love it. But everybody's just moving on from the, the Scarecrow then, that Walks at Midnight. Oh yeah, Scarecrow that Walks at Midnight. Yes, that one was a good one. And Calling All Creeps. And Calling All Creeps. Eat your damn cookies. 
<laughs> I'm turning. And what is this one? It came from beneath the sink. Is that that uh, killer potato? It's the sponge. Oh, and sponge. it does have a, a vampire potato thing. <laughs> if it doesn't get but any I worse. But I loved it. And then that little. <laughs> that was bad. That little demon baby in the next one. Yeah. It's good. It was good. Yeah, that killer sponge. And this one. Mikhail, if you're watching, you love mummies. So this is Return of the Mummy. And we got this one, Half Price Books. I don't know if I've seen this one. I don't what know. What does it have on the back? Netflix has every single episode so of So Netflix Goosebumps. right now, you can watch Goosebumps. On so, there. yeah, it has three, of uh, three, what is it? Return of the Mummy, Don't Wake Mummy, and You Can't Scare Me. There you go, Mikhail. That rock looking. You say you don't know what to watch? There you go. You get to catch up on all your. Go be hitting all your goosebumps. And, yes, goosebumps. Viewer beware. Now the only thing that I thought was weird about goosebumps is that. <laughs> get that COVID cough out of here. Let me try to get that COVID cough out. Of here. <laughs> is that the haunted mask was the most popular and it never went to DVD? Yeah, it's Ever. just VHS, right? Yeah. I yeah. So weird. that one's one of their most popular. Ones. Well, because your mother's kind of ghetto, and I had someone, I think your dad, he took it from the VHS that I had. Oh, yeah, I recorded it. Right. I recorded it to a it DVD disc. DVD. With Carly Beth. That's how we watched it. I still have it like that. <laughs> so we were kind of ghetto. <laughs> and you loved it. We watched it almost, we watched Goosebumps almost every night before y'all went to bed. I remember watching Goosebumps and you slept the game to bed. All right, so hopefully Trick or Treat Studios will bring, get the license back and they'll start making these again and that they'll start making new ones. But till then, they don't have the license. I emailed them at Trick or Treat Studios to find out. But uh, hoping 2022 is coming up and then uh, they'll make some major announcements on their new products and everything. Hopefully they'll get the license back. They're trying to get it back. There's people saying that they are getting it back. But like I said, they False. said... Yeah, they said it's false for now. Well, I hope they get it back. So when they get it, because I'm pretty sure they will, because it did really good for them. When they get it back, you'll be first to know on Dark Dimensions Haunted House. But till then, viewer beware, you're in for a scare. I they never get Thanks it. for watching. Please like and subscribe. This is Dark Dimensions Haunted House. Scary. <laughs> Scary.